Oi. Ik ben hemel. A young woman struggles with her emotions when the one man she cares deeply about her. Equally, the restless father finally finds true love. This film is a 2012 release drama, and the name of the movie is Hamel. Hamel is a young woman. Somewhere in her mid-twenties, she's searching for something. It would be lower it is just a physical relationship. There is an emptiness inside her, a part of her devoid of emotional fulfillment. She wants to fill this. She tries sleeping around and having a few one-night stands. This is all very casual to her. She thinks nothing of sleeping with someone. She just met and has no problem. Kai chatting with him afterward has one encounter leading into the next. We have to start to wonder how and why she's so non about all of this. She very obviously enjoys physical relations and the pleasure that it brings her but seems resistant to actually making any sort of connection to her partner belong. Physical, the most important person. Ham's life is guys. Her father works in an auction house after the early passing of her mother. Hamel grew up with him alone, just like him. Guys are restless and aren't connected to anyone. Expect his daughter. She is only close to her father. A relationship that is belonging, symbolic, and seems unhealthy, codependent. It seems, her father who raised her on his phone has been somewhat of a playboy. That is, until he meets the Amo co-worker Sophie. His relationship with Sophie clearly threatens Hamel, who we have seen in several one-night stand scenario ragging from a physically intimate moment with a man named Mohammed, and a more violent scenario like a hookup that could endangered her, which she recollects giving it a party to avoid. Talking about her real feeling he always seems to be into crosses, Walger talks, always circulating about physical relations, which has always been used only has a means of escapism, though it has seemed clear. She seeks intimacy, as she seemed to learn from his father. Physical relation and intimacy are clearly separate, so the fact that he has settled for a woman unites this. 